Right. Ware County High School spent the afternoon in lockdown after a teacher reported they heard gunshots. Law enforcement found no evidence of gunshots at or near campus and students were released after hours of sheltering. Our Zach Wilcox is joining us live from the school in Waycross tonight. And Zach, I know you spoke with several students who were rattled by what they experienced earlier today. Yeah, Anthony, as soon as they went into lockdown, kids started texting other kids. They started texting their parents. Rumors started circling on Facebook with people fearing the worst. Fortunately, nobody was injured. There was no need to arrest anyone because there was no evidence of shots fired, but certainly was an experience that a lot of these high schoolers won't forget. Started out as normal as it usually does. I went the first block, okay, second block, okay, third block was okay for half, half of it, and then they had an officer come in saying to put us on the bleachers and go into lockdown. Sean Gale spent the next two hours crouched under the bleachers, waiting to find out what was going on. I was just praying to God that they weren't coming in, in the, in the gym. Superintendent Bert Smith says the school automatically went into lockdown after a teacher signaled an emergency. She thought she heard some shots and she was just reacting like she thought, you know, like she was supposed to. I mean, using our alert system. When that teacher pressed the button on her lanyard, it alerted several law enforcement agencies to get to the school. No one's been injured. Uh, no one has, you know, been identified. There was no shots. I mean, again, we'll look at the tape and we have our camera system that does audio and visual so we can we can hear things. Smith says a silver lining of the incident is that the alert system worked properly and it gives them a chance to review what can be improved for next time. I think, you know, you can always communicate better. I think I'm just glad that our folks and are proud of their patience and their understanding and because it, it was a we we're a little uptight today for sure. And Smith said out of an abundance of caution, they went ahead and put every other school in the district on a soft lockdown today. And the plan for tomorrow is to have a normal day here in Ware County Schools. In Waycross, Zach Wilcox, First Coast News, on your side.